And a merry hubness to you as well. Welcome back to The Hub, ladies and gentlemen, where we show you the most interesting and funny videos floating around the internet. Stay tuned to see what's so weird about all of these birds, except one. Three, two, one, go. Introduce yourself to Atlas, developed by Boston Dynamics. He's the world's first ever robot to jump. This opens up a whole new world in robot technology. As you can see, Boston Dynamics often just goes out into the woods, as this woman discovered, and tests their things out in public. Uh, a little scary to meet that on the hiking trail. Some folks in Japan are trying to blow every other country out of the water by creating the world's tallest walking and moving robot. Would you hang out inside this thing? While Japan is going for size, the folks at MIT in Boston are going for the opposite of size. This is the world's smallest moving robot. It can move things, it can climb over obstacles, and it can even swim. This is a fun animation that shows what Pac-Man would look like if he lived in Venice. Some scientists were having trouble getting some good footage and studying the life of wild dogs, so they thought, hey, let's just build a fake wild dog and stick it out where they live to get some really up-close shots. Pretty clever spy technology here. But the wild dogs is not the first time this technology has been used. As you can see here in New Zealand, they made stone gannets. It's a type of bird so that it would bring other wild gannets back to this location. There's one bird named Nigel who thought they were real and he died after 20 years of trying to spend time with them. And while stone gannets may be cool, it's not nearly as cool as this little pocket that holds your phone and prevents it from falling in the toilet. Not that my phone ever fell in the toilet. I wouldn't possibly use it if it fell. Never mind. And here's one more final creepy invention that you can use to make your fingernails look like teeth. It's a little molding that you put over there. I don't know why anyone would do this to themselves. I, I didn't do it to myself either. I haven't dropped my phone in the toilet or my nails. Never mind again. Fun shout out to Tetra Sky and Candace Argo for leaving us comments. Leave a comment below and I'll put my favorite one in our next video. Give us a like, give us a subscribe, and we'll see you again very, very soon. We're right back here on The Hub. Bye-bye.